Here's Ace of Sega 24, and welcome uh, to a Lego Worlds tutorial. And today, hey, I'm going to show you how to create custom brick build models in in from Lego Digital Designer, or as seen here. Or so. Oh, well, let's get into it. So first off, we're going to need. Let's let's make a list of what you need. First, you you're going to need um. Uh, Lego Digital Designer. You're also going to need need a you uh, an uh, option a no little brick filt brick filt brick filter or this th it just filters out the bricks so that um you can um know what goes in Lego World and what doesn't and so uh, that so we have uh, I have. Like a digital designer, her got that. Now let's get the brick filter. Her now this vi now this video by Paul Storrs Jr. Her shows s a similar process, but the the palette. The in fact, we'll go to we'll try and download it. Her and let's. And it it doesn't work. It doesn't work. So instead, I've this I found this this topic. It's pinned by this p person whose icon is a Pokemon. He created a folder for it as well. So we're going to we it goes to a OneDrive, and they they've actually been nice enough to to do all, all the bricks that are in version one point uh, version the old the old versions of Lego World and new one. We'll download the new one. And and there's this wait uh we'll download uh Aha here it is. Save. Alright, we're scanning your download just to be safe. Good my anti -way. Open folder. Now, this is now it's a bit of a complicated process to get to from from this folder into this folder. Or, or, or so let's go for the process. Wait, let's go through the process now. Oh, no, go to the search bar and type in percent. Ah, up. D A T A. Hey. App data percent, and it'll open up the folder. Let's see, now we have all the games. So we we want our le the Lego. Oh, you can download Digital Designer from here. Or there's the, the uh, we just you can just if you have if you, you can just Google Lego Digital Designer or something. I might include a link. Link or something. We'll close that. That, but it's about we. You're here in the roaming folder, and we want Lego Company, Lego Digital Designer, and we're going to create a new folder. Title it Capital U User Palettes. Now, follow my naming. This is, I'm pretty sure this is important. Follow it just as I do. Capital U S E R, Capital P A L E T T E S, all one word, and enter. Now, we're going to take our take the uh, Default, take this, this, and drag it into here, into move to user palettes, and there it is. So let's close out of these two windows. Close, close, uh, uh, minimize Internet Explorer. We got the brick filter, so let's. Got that, and now we're we done with that. Let, hold on, I forgot I have to go, hold, go to free build and, and I foolishly had this open so let's just open that back up Oop, there we go and um what's going on <coughs> let's uh, 
okay here we go we're gonna go into under digital design uh, view key, my, not my stores or extended one this tab right here the, the blue tab go into free build and open filter bricks by hey I can't read that let's go and if you did everything if you follow my instructions you should see a two fill two tabs one for hero factory that was there by default and one for Lego worlds we're gonna click on that and there are all the bricks that we can use we can use for Lego worlds we have of a wide variety actually of possible things so let's hmm what shall we make I'm hmm let's Let's make. Let's make a. Uh. Huh. Um. Let, well, for, well, first we want to filter bricks by color. And these, this will show you just all the bricks in general. Let's make make a a Minecraft grass block. Because, um, in and do for scaling, let's filter this to a to reddish brown. For scaling, it's five plates. It's five plates. It's five plates tall for every two plates wide. So, oh, we just multiply five times two, and we get a total of ten plates tall. Well, it's going to be a 10 plate tall build. So, let's get build it. To build this, we're going to need a 4x4 four four plate to start with. And we'll build. The Actually, let's see if there's a 4x4 four four brick. There isn't, so we'll just use two. We'll just use two 2x4s. Two there's. There's. And. And um, we'll rotate the thing. Okay, that's three plates. One brick is three plates tall. So, if I remember correctly, a grass block should. So, if we do, if we rotate this using the arrow keys, a grass block should be like that. That's good. Then we go into our plates tab. And we grab a three, three by three plate, and then we filter it to bright yellowy green no that's too bright for now we'll filter it down to earth green in plate one by two hey a one by one unplate eight and a one by th a one by three and another one by one in, in, right there then we're going to cap it off we're gonna do that, and it's a little confusing to get that out of the right orientation. We're gonna do that, and hold on, did that wrong? V key, there are shortcut, there are keyboard shortcuts. And now, how many plates is that? It's one. That's three, six, eight, uh, uh, three, six, eight. So there's two more layers of plates. So I say, what? I say we do, do just one. We do um, this, this, and uh, we put another one of these, and then we do this. We'll Orient right, okay. and we'll do two one by ones for the top, top. and then to cap it all off, I'll I'll use the clone tool and copy a bunch of one by ones onto it, 
the one by one tile, or these one by one tiles, onto this. Then we can start painting this the correct color. Because as, as great as this looks, it is bland. And, and it is not the correct color for Minecraft grass blocks. So we're going to need to paint one of these like this, paint another like this, paint another like this. And this is just. And we're going to keep doing this until we get the right color. So we finish this off, uh, and um, hmm. my face cam's in the way. We yeah, hold on. Okay, might have fixed it. There we go. We go here and here. Wait, no, I don't want to recolor the bricks. So we do this and this. And this, and maybe a bit of this. We're going to want to go here and there. We, there's that. And we'll recolor that to this, and this to this. This, and this to this. Down here, we make that that color, and this to that color. We'll keep that that color. We'll keep that the normal. Oh no, no. We'll keep that the normal color and put this here and put this to here or this is harder than I thought mm. make this that we'll put this color to this this and we'll make that this to that that okay now that we have our grass block we need to save it hit and we go to file export model we just save this under this file type, X L O L X F M L. And the and that is actually the same they actually hint at this in Lego World during the loading screens. It says it's the rocket says it's fun to look work in the X L, -L X F M L. So we need to save this as mine craft um grass block. And save. So toolbox, and we also need screenshot. So, and let's get a nice screenshot. Let's focus in on about the middle, right there. And let's zoom in. Let's zo let's get this right there. Toolbox. Take screenshot. There. Then to get to out of this, we need to go to. Um, hold on. Where is it? Where are we? Oh, we need to go to documents, Lego creations, models, save this as, and we just type in M, Minecraft grass block, and we just chop off the dot L X F M L. Oh, and save as a PNG. Okay, and we are done with digital designer. And don't say, save. Okay, so we need, let's open up a new window. Let's go, let's open up the documents folder, go to Lego creations, models, then we need to press, press control to select both of them. Then we go into, we want to do the whole app data thing, thing again, then we go into save games, into, we, wait, hold on. If you have it in Rome, you have it in Rome, go to Warner Brothers Interactive with Entertainment. Go into Lego Worlds, go into Save Games, go into Content, and there's, this may look confusing, but it's really e easy. You just type in SYS and search for SYS Glo and it'll and SYS Global will come up. So you want to go into Mods and under a subfolder for Models, so, and then we drag these into there and. Then we're done with this. This I probably should have copied those instead of um, uh, doing that, but I'll fix it later. So we want to oh, launch Lego Worlds. Yeah. And um, if you like this style of video, please like and subscribe.
okay, if I know that you're, um, enjoy, that you enjoy this. So, so, please, yeah, did anybody actually, and uh, what is going on here? I'll just let it leave, I'll leave it alone, I'll leave it alone. Only because the la I actually tried to record this yesterday, but I botched up the recording, and I forgot to turn the sound on again, but this is a tutorial, so it doesn't matter. Anyway, hey, um, actually, hold, I'll turn on the sound real quick. Wait, oh, this is also a tutorial, a sub-tutorial, sub-tutorial. So, oh, if you, if you're having trouble with your Elgato thing, hang, use actually music, the music thing, hang, hang, and, um, uh, it's not capturing because it needs to, so, but trust me, it works, it works, it works, eh, and, um, the re- I don't know what the black screen is, but it's just- Oh, wait, there we- So, so, middle mouse click to skip. We just need to m maximize that. Press enter. Here. Then, we're going- We're going to let it load. fun to work in the LXFML. Okay, finally, we're here. We're here, we're here, we're here, we're here, we're here, we're here, we're here. Hooray! Okay, and I, and I may, and I may, and yesterday in the recording, I, I, Made a stone slab from Minecraft, and I didn't use a reference image, image, so I think that's pretty good. But today, oh, you see, here, here's a grass block. Here's a grass block. See, it's nice. See, it worked. Everything worked. So that's what I wanted to show you today. Hey. Leave a like and subscribe if you like this. Obviously, he. Oh, let's do, <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's in there. Hey, anyway, he. He. Thanks for watching, and I will hopefully see you tomorrow. My name is Drinker Twenty Four, and until then, bye bye.